so what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel welcome to what's going to be a special unboxing yeah i bought myself a, a something off of facebook marketplace from somebody i know in one of my groups i got myself an art the clown slash terrifier collection yeah somebody sold me their art the clown slash terrifier collection and so i got all the goodies in this box and from what i can see looks pretty good eh yeah you think so i, I think so i think Everybody's going to like what's in this box. Yeah, what are we waiting for? We'll get art out of the way and we'll come back in here and we'll open up this box. What are we wait for. Let's go. Welcome back to the program. If you're just tuning in, I'm sitting here live with the sole survivor of the Miles County Massacre, which occurred exactly one year ago today. So what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Jeff Man 316 Pop Culture Reporter channel. I'm your host, as always, Jeff Man 316. And like I said, we're going to open up a Terrifier slash Art the Clown box. I'm just going to go ahead and tell you, if you're familiar with the This Is Art um, umbrella set, that, that and the, it's the big collection with everything that comes in it. Um, yeah, I got that, but I got everything in this box cheaper than what most people would normally pay for that off of eBay. So, yeah, this guy cut me a great deal. There's multiple action figures in here, and I'm not sure which one this came with, but there's a trading card that I was that I had loose in here that I pulled out of Art the Clown. It says it's from Knucklehead Toys. I think there's a couple of Knucklehead Toys figures in here. This is a Knucklehead Toys half-pint figure of Art the Clown. I'm pretty sure this came with the with the uh, this is art set. So we'll look at all the stuff that was with that first. So, but I don't know if that card came with that. But um, I know this did. This was some swag that came with that set. So look at that. Should I wear these during the video? I don't know if I'll be able to see. What do you think of these glasses? Yeah, he likes them too. So yeah, I think it might be a little too difficult. Um, but either way, maybe I'll, like I said, I'll do, uh, I'll, um, do this maybe, and that'll be what I use for the, that'll be what I use for the thumbnail either way. So we'll stop back and silly and what I should get into the, into the box. So, like I said, I'm pretty sure that figure came with the, this is art set. These glasses came with it. Um, it came with this VHS tape. Which, I don't know that I'm going to be able to play it because it says it's in PAL. you got to remember, Umbrella is from Australia. So, there's the front. There's the back. The sides. And here's what the tape looks like. So, either way, that's more of a collectible than anything else. So, I doubt I would even be trying to play it. Um, you get the set of vinyl decals. Basically everything cool in there. Look, that chick hanging upside down was nude. They got her obviously with clothes on. So that's kind of cool. You get a poster, which I believe is basically the artwork that was used on the Blu-rays. So there's one side. There's the other. Getting up close view of it. Those two items, like I said, I've looked through everything to make sure it was a good condition where it's sealed in that, so I'll seal it back. Um, and then I'm pretty sure that's it other than the actual set itself. So there's actually three more other three items left in the box that I will show you that were other. So everything so far, I'm pretty sure, was in the deluxe This Is Art set. So there's the, the Blu-ray. I, I actually already own this, so this would be more of a collector's item. It's they are numbered. There's only 1,500 of these sets. This is number 1,134. So this is the This Is Art collection. You get the three movies, All Hallows Eve, Terrifier, Terrifier 2. Um, most of the stuff from Umbrella is not um, region coded. You get all the special uh, features, and you get um, some, other stuff, some other swag in here. So let's get this bad boy open, and we'll look at it really thick hard box reminds me of what the halloween set came in so you get terrifier and it came with reversible art um they always put the 
like rating logos and stuff on there. So I reversed it. There's Terrifier and it includes All Hallows Eve on there as a special feature. Let me make sure there's no nudity on there. Then you get Terrifier 2. That's pretty much the standard artwork used on all the Blu-ray releases. It includes director's commentary, extended Boo Crew interviews, and behind the scenes. So I probably will never really play these movies. I already own them. Um, it's more just as a collector's item. The swag that you get with this is cool. You get a cool set of art cards. I mean, they're, they're, it's a lot of them. You get this book. This is art, and I've looked in it, and there is some nudity, I think, in some of these, and some gross stuff, but there's, like, some behind the scenes. The one thing I didn't like about it is it doesn't cover um, a lot about the first movie, which is All Hallows' Eve. Maybe it's because David Howard Thornton doesn't play art in there. But it covers most of Terrifier and Terrifier 2. So, and I can't show you all that artwork. There are some. But either way, pretty thick book made out of nice thick um, pages there. And then here's like one of the awesome things that came with the set um, is these art cards. There's a, an, uh, speaking of art cards, that's um, Art the Clown from... Um, all Hallows Eve, so you can see he looked a little different there. So then we got this is art from Terrifier 2. Most of this artwork you've probably seen if you're a fan of the movie. It's a lot of publicity stuff. That's used basically on everything. See at the bottom of the card? This is the Art Crispy cereal. Uh, this is her taking the selfie in Terrifier. I really love Terrifier. I like All Hallows' Eve. That's Lauren Lavera when she's in the store with him. That's Art looking not so happy. The Clown Cafe. Art with one of his weapons. Art with his scalpel looking happy. This is a pretty amazing photo of Lauren Lavera. I love that photo there. Badass bitch getting ready to take action it's from Terrifier. So they only have one card from All Hallows Eve. I don't like that. That's her almost looking like Chucky. There's him and his knife. There's Art up to no good. We got two more up close of Art. And then we've got, um, there you go. So that's all, all of those came inside of the box. So that's the This Is Art box. Now, the box itself, I know you could get this separate with just this, the movies and that stuff. You had to pay extra to get the VHS, the figure, the poster, the decals, the vinyl decals, and then these glasses. So, so I got this figure here. It's the Terrifier Bloodbath Art the Clown figure with bloody color change in action. So I probably won't open this, but I thought that was a pretty damn good figure. It's, it's got a weird packaging. It's long. Um, it actually had a little bend on the corner, but I, I saw that in his photos. Um, from what I'm seeing, a lot of people, because of the how extended this package is, that happens on a lot of them. But if you get the figure wet, he turns bloody. So I probably won't open this right now. I might later. Um, the next one is basically a larger figure similar to the other one we got. But it's it's the it's a big one. Stylized. Knucklehead stylized Terrifier Art the Clown figure. Comes with his weapons. There's a good photo of it on the back. There's what the art looks like. Get it art. And then the last thing I got, he had at least three or four autographs of David Howard Thornton, and I picked the one that I liked the best. He let me pick, and this is the autograph photo I got. So, man, I mean, I think he charges, what, 30, 40, 50 bucks, something like that? I don't know, for his autograph at those conventions. So, I'm just telling you, I got all of this cheaper than it would, you would have ended up getting that, that one set if you bought it um, off of eBay. So, um, 
we're going to close out the video here. You can let me know what you think. What did you think of all my Art the Clown stuff? Like, comment, subscribe, share, do all the normal YouTube stuff. I'll keep making videos if you keep watching. If you are a subscriber, don't forget to hit the notification bell. You'll know when I post new videos. So, yeah, what did you guys think of all my Terrifier Art the Clown stuff? Nothing. Yeah, I think it's pretty cool. So, until next time, boys and girls, this has been Jeffman316. Art and I will see you later in the next video. I'm going to say, close it out by saying, you guys be safe out there.